So I'm first on the launch queue and someone else coming down there I can see, that's good. Today's forecast for a 10,000 foot day, but uh, not looking like it yet. Well, let's see how we get on, maybe later in the day uh, we might get some high, uh, high cloud base. Let's we'll see how it goes. It's uh, a lot of bit of cirrus to the north there. Hopefully that pushes out the way. And um, let's hope we have a good day. Just check the. Yeah, they all look good. Just got a low save here. Uh, just uh, after launch, I. Uh, didn't manage to get a decent climb. I thought I had something, but uh, it all petered out. So uh, I'm gonna stick with this for the moment. It's um, airfield's just over here, so got glide back. Well, yeah, that's all right. And the day's looking good. I just want to get a decent climb first for my first thermal and then uh, head north that way looking good there uh, this thermal is going four and a half knots that's quite nice just climbing through three and a half thousand now just coming up to Pittsworth now I'm at four and a half cloud base seems to be a bit lower here than uh, near Warwick um, Still looking good though going north, so that's the plan. Uh, I might deviate slightly to the right here. Uh, or possibly, uh, could go left. Uh, there's a bit of a little blue hole behind this cloud, so I'm just trying and line up my next uh, route. I really would like a bit more height than this. Uh, it's, uh, the wind is saying 15 knots uh, easterly, it's picked up uh, since left Warwick. Uh, so. yeah. uh, there's Toowoomba there in the distance, looking good over there too. So here's Darling Down Soaring Club, uh, looks like there's only one glider out, it's a bit of a surprise. Uh, so, I'm turning now and I'm going to head generally in the direction uh, back and then uh, I'll see if I can go down to Stanford because it's uh, looking quite good down to the south still. North wasn't so good, there's no point going to uh, the Bunyas because uh, there's a big sort of blue hole here and uh, uh, lots of cirrus. There's a bushfire there. Um, oh, there's the tug coming in. So I'm heading uh, southwest now to Milmarin. It's looking good now. Um, I turned to DGSC because there's no point going further north with all that cirrus and uh, uh, shaded cloud, and uh, it's much better to the south. So uh, maybe after Milmarin, um, try uh, trekking to Stanford. So there's uh, Milmarinum nose, nice cloud above it. So it's um, the direction I'll head, and then I'm thinking and tracking over that way, over the scrub a bit. So uh, yeah, looking good out west, but uh, a lot of dense scrub west and. It's not high cloud base at the moment, it's only uh, 
just above 6,000. So uh, not a day for me to go in over the scrub. Well, let's see how we get on. So we're heading towards Inglewood in the moment. Uh, I've got 32 to run. And the clouds are looking good this way. They're nice, uh, nice flat bottomed. Uh, so I'm just going to cross this line of scrub. And uh, let's see how we get on. Uh, I got just under uh, 7,000. Uh, and Brian was reporting uh, 8,000 above the scrub to the west of Milmarin. Uh, anyway, let's see how we get on. So we just had a cracking nine knot climb uh, under the cloud. I'm now uh, 10k north of Inglewood, which is just on my nose there. Uh, so that'll be my turn point. And then looking that way, I can head most probably along that line of cloud and uh, track towards uh, Warwick uh, directly. So I think that's the route I'll take. Still looking good. And cloud base uh, almost near 9,000 feet there. Beauty. Plenty of scrub here. And that's uh, Lake Leslie there. I oh, know, uh, not Leslie, that's the other one, uh, name I've forgotten. So this is an interesting way back. I haven't been this way before in this direction. Uh, you can see the wind turbines uh, coming up. I believe they're the, uh, the biggest in the southern hemisphere. Uh, they just started the wind from uh, uh, a couple of months ago. Not operational yet. Uh, so I'm going to track under this cloud here and then uh, I've got to uh, just about glide into Warwick now. I'm at 7,000, which is good. Uh, there's been some nice climbs above this scrub. It's a pretty uh, wild looking area. There's a, a small strip at uh, Gore, which I've got plugged in. It's on my nose, that's uh, 22 kilometers away. And Warwick is 67 on the nose now. now. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but uh, there's the uh, wind turbines uh, on my nose here getting installed. Uh, this is just near Gore. So I've got uh, 45 to run to Warwick. And it's just on my nose now. Uh, I've got seven and a half, six and a half, so I've got uh, 600 spare to get in, as long as I don't get hit any heavy sink. Uh, yeah. So I'm uh, 35 kilometers out from the airfield, I can just see it in the distance. Um, just going through 6,000 foot now, and it's uh, a bit of a blue hole, but I'm not so uh, worried about it. I've got safe glide anyway, 1,000 foot above, so should make it. And here you can see the sort of tracks they're putting in for the uh, the wind farm, the uh, access roads. Still cloud over that way. I'm just wondering if I can connect with it. Um, see how we get on. Well, once I get closer to the airfield, maybe I can push into wind a bit and uh, connect with those clouds and have another uh, run along them. So nice view of the airfield here, and uh, got 6,000 foot. So I'm just gonna be. Sort of cloud chasing, I think, and uh, we'll see what a 
if I can push up to the walls of the range and uh, uh, it's still relatively early it's uh, just after three quarter past um, so no point landing just yet uh, it's, uh, turned out to be a really good day it's uh, We we'll have to uh, explore the Inglewood, first time there in a long while. And let's have a look at this. So I burnt all my height off on the um, Eastern side of the uh, western side of the range, uh, eastern side of the airfield, and uh, I'm just running now. It's uh, wind is east southeasterly, so I'll be landing on zero nine grass right. And, uh, they're still going, but uh, I'm quite happy having enough for the moment and uh, call it a day. So, nice landing, not a problem. I just have to walk to the car and uh, looks like Whiskey Golf Hogarek coming in. Finger flight looks like. <laughs> PW6 That's sweet